It's like people, it's like people love for you to feel bad or feel sad or feel like you can't make it without them. Because they'll they 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 claim, oh yeah, we we mess with you and we like you and we love you and this is that and the other. But then when it all boils down, everything that, that came out their mouth is a dang lie. And I'm not like I'm not sitting here trying to just be, you know, some bitter person or some, you know, somebody ignorant. No, no. Factually, people literally tell you, oh, I care about you and I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that and blah, blah, blah. But then when it comes down to it, you either can't find them or they just. They was just telling you something that you wanted to hear. I don't understand why. And I don't, you know what? And it's not even, I don't even understand why. I really don't even care. I really don't care. Okay. I am more of like, when does the BS stop? Like, Lord, when will it end? When will it end? Because it's become it's it 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 has become ridiculous. It doesn't make sense no more. You know, this is why people have so much distrust in their heart because either everybody's just backwards or just liars. I don't know what else to call it. Backwards or liars. If you're backwards, you worship the devil. If you're a liar, you worship the devil. And this saying, I just went through so much. I'm steady going through so much. I just have no, I'm, I just, I'm losing my faith in people. You no, know, never really had all my faith in people. I would ask God to, I would ask God to put, you know, to, 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 to put things on a certain person's heart to, you know, to be favorable of me. You know, see if the Lord will show me favor. You know, see if God will show me favor, but I keep, I don't know. I just, I just keep, I just keep being, I don't know. And I can't keep calling on people. I'm steady. I can't keep calling people and saying, hey, can you help me? And it's, it's I'm over that. I'm so over it. I don't want to call nobody else and ask them for help. I just don't. I'm tired of it. Because I know I'm able. I am extremely able to do stuff on my own and make stuff happen by myself. Only thing is, is, you know, you get people... Who don't want to see you in the in a in a good position, so they send spirits to block you. They send um, they send bad like whenever somebody speaks a a a negative word about you out their mouth, that's them speaking a curse on you, speaking a a curse, speaking a curse against you. And it's like, why would you do that? Why would you speak a curse against me? Because even if I didn't do anything to you, you want to speak a curse against me. I hope it fails or I hope you don't make it or I hope they live. People literally do that out of their own spiteful, nasty heart. Nasty. 
Like, it's like, you need to get your own heart together because you will never benefit in the grace of God. You will never benefit from the grace of God or you will never benefit from the favor of God with that in your heart. Ever. Ever. And I'm speaking, yeah, I'm speaking from my own experience. I don't speak that type of way towards people. God bless you. And I mean that. Like, God bless you. I don't have no ill will, no ill nothing towards you. Nothing. I don't have anything bad to say. You know, no matter the circumstance, I'm not going to speak bad against you. I'm not doing it. Cause it doesn't it that doesn't help me. That could get me out of the favor of God. Like that can get me out of the favor of the Lord. So I'm not gonna speak bad against you. Of course, if there is a conversation, it's gonna be brought up that this is what happened. This is, you know, what you know your your intention was too. And only God can judge what your real intention was. Only God can judge what he saw in your heart when you spoke that word against me or against anybody else. Or if anybody spoke a, a bad word against you or spoke a curse against you. God can see what the intent of the heart was. He can look at the whole situation. He can see how it happened. He can see how you started to feel the way that you felt. And then if you ask for help from him, that's when he'll 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 start working on that very thing that got that seed planted in your heart to get rid of it. People need to understand this. I've been through a lot and I'm always it, it seems I'm always going through a lot. I always get a lot of people who just do not like me. I always get a lot of people who just do not want anything to do with me without reason. They have no cause. It's just this just how they feel. They have hatred in their heart. And when they speak things, they're speaking curses. They can speak a curse against you. Which can which can um it can it can it can Bring a spirit. Life and death is in the power of the tongue. The Lord says, Watch what you say. Watch what you say. Don't speak negativity. Life and death is in the power of the tongue. Hello. That scripture alone goes the longest way you can ever imagine. Just, people, watch what you say. Stop letting the devil use you to do his bidding for him. Because that gets you out of the favor of the Lord. Like, stop it. You have to understand that this is, like, it's not a game now. Like, it's real serious. God is literally, really, literally, literally, really involved. He's involved. And I don't hear to tell y'all that because I love y'all and I want everybody to have a good have a good day and watch what you say.